All right, doing a little recording, trying to see. Well, it's time to check my 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 flags and see if I'm actually got a bug going on with um, some of my romance paths I've got going on here. So what I've done is I've updated a more current version of the Baldur's Gate 3 script extender available uh, for f download either on GitHub or you can easily get uh, get it off Nexus Mods too, which also just has worked. But if I went to get it off GitHub and in doing so, there's two different flavors. There's the one with non uh, console debug commands and the one with. You want the one that has the console commands. And what that does is when you open up a new game, uh, you get something like this. So I'm just scrolling up. And you can see this is the this is the debug console um, and you see just as loading this save you get all these like you know basically it breaks down all the load processes all the mods that you've installed everything that you could possibly think of to be doing so I think first and foremost I need to figure out what the heck my player uh, you, you <laughs> what my player UUID is I can't even Get it. So that is one of the places, and I'll link uh, in in the comments of the description down below where you can get this information. If you just follow the post along, it should theoretically work. Okay. Let's try that again. All right. So the important thing to grab... Uh, it's showing who's all in my party right now. So the two things I absolutely need are this UUID here. That's that's my character. Um, in this case, it's a custom. And uh, since I'm currently romancing Shadowheart, I want hers as well. So I want to go ahead and capture that on the notepad real quick. I've got off to the side. But you want to uh, save that information. So that's the important step. Now next is to figure out uh, what tags I'm getting. If I am currently dating someone, which I should be, according to this game, I should get a tag uh, from copy and pasting this line to get Shadow Hearts info near EOF. Huh. If it's empty, then I'm not dating anyone. That might explain. I wonder if there's a bug, at least uh, on my end, that kind of does something. Because I completed her, her, her thing, but... Like, her quest line's done at this point. Let me... Another step forward. Because something's gone wrong. Did you want something? If not, I'm perfectly happy to just gaze upon your work. Of course. Yeah, you would not get just the option... One to be able to kiss her if, <laughs> if you were not dating her uh, and at least hadn't already experienced uh, one of the cutscenes already, if not several by this point. I mean, we're deep into Act 3. I wonder if the process of her sacrificing her parents possibly changes uh, the flags that are involved with, like, the romance options. So, I mean, I normally wasn't going to record this, but I'm, I'm not thrilled with having that same problem that they had the first time because I went through the entire game, completed it, and never got the final scene for that. So, uh, so let me copy some lines here since the game thinks I am not dating someone, or at least deep in the code, it believes I'm not. So we take those two previous 
uh, identifiers and let me just build this here it is theoretically possible to use this method to more or less get around uh, dating multiple multiple people uh, for what I'm read even those who are strictly uh, monogamous and uh, especially those who don't uh, like uh, polyamory relationships uh, <laughs> so this could be a viable solution to get around it so this is what it looks like I kind of took, had to build it off screen but that should theoretically work so let's copy a previous line this and if it works yes okay now we have dating information <laughs> Okay. So let's get a little bit more advanced. We're partnered, okay. Oh. I think I just found a much quicker solution. Okay, I might have to go To Rivington. I'm recording right now, right? Yeah, I'm 14 minutes in. You know, that would make sense. Because it seems like it would happen while you're in Rivington. Now, granted, I don't know exactly how far this is going to work. It'll be up to you to just kind of figure it out as well as do your own research. But I will say that Reddit has been absolutely invaluable in making um, progress as to this. So... Uh... Initially, I guess there was no dating, but it moved on to partner, but eh, okay. <laughs> Night shift, oh, it's getting dippy. All right. So that's done. We'll go to camp. Where is she camped at? All right, I need to go long rest in Riverton. So if this ends up working, I will go ahead and put the relevant posts um, for all this stuff that I've been doing uh, down in the description below. And the actual scene's just gonna have to be its own separate, you know. <laughs> Bingo. Yeah, so I'm going to go ahead and get this squared away here. <laughs> 